We may just have one of the best communities out there of all time. That's because yesterday we were streaming for our 140,000 subscriber special live and we gained over 550 subs. I've never had that happen the entire time I've been streaming and playing Call of the Wild. And that is why you guys are all incredible, amazing people. So thank you guys so much for that. It is definitely an honor. Thank you so much. And what I want to do today is tell you about my favorite spot that I found for quail. We just got a call from our first quail right up here in this cornfield. So we're going to work our way over there and ease our way into this corn. But we're not going to run. We're just going to walk. And if he calls again, we might crouch if we have to. But I think we should be all right just walking right in the direction that we last heard that quail. Here they come. Here they come. Here they come. Oh, smoked him. Smoked another one. Smoked another one. Reload, reload, reload. Oh my god. We hit the jackpot. We literally hit the jackpot. They are everywhere. Smoked them. I think we might have just doubled up. I wouldn't say it was a smoke shot, but... Uh... <laughs> I think we just doubled up. I think we just doubled up. And I don't know if you guys heard me before during the stream, but I absolutely cannot stand this huge F icon that pops up every single time we're about to take a shot on a quail. <laughs> there they go. One, two, three, four of them. Five of them. Here we go. Here we go, baby. Let it fly. Let it fly. Look at them all. Oh, man. They're a little bit too far away, but honestly... Oh, we're empty. We're doing decent. Holy quail. We hit the jackpot of quail. We literally hit the jackpot. I think we just got about six or seven of them as they're flying out across here. Can you imagine what the hunting pressure is like? <laughs> wow. That right there is probably like seven or eight quail that we took down all around us right here. And there's more. There's more. Let's go over here and get this one as well. Don't worry. We're going to come back here and pick up all these quail in a little bit. But right now, we're just going to take down as much as possible. Look at There's blood there. Blood there. We got quail here. Quail there. Um, I don't know where this one went because it called right here and I don't see any sign of it. So, all right. Well, let's start picking some of these up. All right, let's pick this one up and took him at 42 yards a 190 brown female there We got one right here right in the middle of the road All right, a red brown took him at 44 yards into decent male 162 Just have a look right now. We don't have our tracks on but we can literally see four quail one two three four four quail Maybe five quail all right here. Let's start picking some of these up here. They're so difficult to see. There we go, a big old gold gray. That might be our biggest and our coolest looking male quail that we've taken. And we took him at 42 yards out. That's a cool looking quail. We're getting him mounted for sure. And then we got another one down over here. Looks like this one might have dropped right on the spot. There's a 201 female. Actually, it's a small male. And then over here, we got two more stacked up right here. All right, let's pick this one up. And a 196 female. I think there might have been two here, to be honest. I thought I saw an icon pop up twice. No, nope, maybe not. We got this one here. A nice left lung shot at 22 yards out. A small female. And then we took that double over here. And we hit another one over there. We got blood right here. And we got more blood here. And we got a quail down right over here. All right, let's swing by here and pick this one up. There we go. That's going to be another female 52 yards out 214 and then the double we took over here. It's going to be quite interesting to find these guys. There's some blood right here. There should be two of them. Oh, a raccoon. So there should be two quail. There's one down right there and the other one is down right next to it. Check that out, guys. We pulled off a double at about 65 yards out and here they are laying right here. Here's going to be this one, 67 yards and it's a small female, brown 183. And then this one down over here, 
Let's find out what that's going to be. It's going to be a male, a red brown, 211 at 65 yards. So that right there was a double at 65 yards with a 20 gauge and the bird shot. All right, guys, let's go over here now and see how many quail we just took down out of that one flock. It was basically like one massive flock. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten quail out of that one flock in that one location. That is an incredible amount of quail all in one spot. And man, we absolutely just pounded those quail. Let's take a look at the hunting pressure. All right, guys, so now that you see how good this spot is, let me show you where this spot is actually at. It is right over here in the middle of the map by Jonesville. Now there's an outpost right here, Jonesville South Mobile Home, but you don't wanna be there because the quail are gonna be super close to this outpost. So what you're gonna to wanna to do is have your tent set up right here and you're gonna be about 250 yards away from where you wanna go. Right here, you set up your tent and you just run this way for a little bit. Once you get to this point here, start walking and ease your way across this road. And once you get to this road here, start crouching because they're gonna be all over. As you can see here, we just absolutely pounded the quail. So when you get to this woods here, you're just going to want to run all the way through it until you get all the way to this cornfield. Once you get to this cornfield, that's when you're going to want to start slowing down and walking a little bit. Anyways, that's going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you next time.